Hey there. Last time we talked about Jesus saying, I am the way, the truth, and the life. And he says that in John chapter 14, verse 6. And this is the night of Passover. Jesus knows what is about to happen. He is hours away from the crucifixion, and he's trying his best to explain to his disciples, I am God. God and I are one. I'm it, guys. He has just predicted Peter's denial. And he says, do not let your hearts be troubled. This is chapter 14, verse 1. Trust in God. Trust also in me. In my Father's house are many rooms. If it were not so, I would have told you. I am going there to prepare a place for you. And if I go and prepare a place for you, I will come back and take you to be with me, that you also may be where I am. You know the way to the place where I am going. Thomas speaks up in verse 5. He says, Lord, the, you haven't told us where you're going yet. We, we don't know. He says, we don't know where you are going, so how can we know the way? Which path do we take? If we don't know the end destination, we're lost. There's a quote in that in Alice in Wonderland that's similar to that. It's like, if you don't know where you're going, any path will do just fine. And Jesus answers him, I am the way and the truth. There is no darkness in God, pure truth and the life. No one comes to the Father except through me. He knows he's going to die, but he knows the resurrection is coming. He knows he will be celebrating first fruits with the disciples. If you really knew me, you would know my Father as well. From now on, you do know him and you have seen him. They're still not getting it because Philip goes, Lord, show us the Father and that'll be enough for us. We'll be good. Humanity, we're so slow sometimes and I can't blame the disciples. Jesus had some really heavy stuff for them. So he tells Philip, don't you know me, Philip? Even after I have been among you for such a long time, Anyone who has seen me has seen the Father. That'd be another good name for him, Father. Oh, well, we did Abba. We did Abba earlier, and Abba is kind of like Father. It's Daddy. He is the way, the truth, and the life. We get so busy sometimes, and we get so tired that it's hard to remember to come back to Jesus, to follow his way, to follow the truth, to live in his resurrected life. We have that power through the Holy Spirit. And that's, that's kind of cool. That's crazy cool. So when you get tired, I know it's Sunday. I hope you had a great weekend. I hope you have a wonderful week, but when you're tempted to tell less than the truth, maybe admit, omit some of the truth. I know I'm guilty. Sometimes there are just certain things I do not want to tell my child yet. Wait till you're older, right? Remember that. Jesus was there. He will be there. He has, he's going to prepare a place for us. It must be a really big house because it has taken him a long time to come back. He is the life. He, tomorrow's word is resurrection. And he knows this is going to happen. So when you look at Jesus, Know that he is the only way. He is the truth about God. 
He is the life that God gives us, that pure and holy redeemed life. Have a great rest of your evening. I'll see you guys later. Bye.